Hey guys, today I'm going to be picking a quick set doorknob block. The pieces I'm going to be using are, of course, my tension wrench, as well as a hook, possibly a half diamond, and a ball rake. First of all, I'm going to start out with the ball rake. It's one of my favorites for picking doorknobs. It's quicker. Let's see, door's unlocked. Lock it up now. What I do is whenever I insert my ball rake into the lock, what I usually do is I insert it uh, just above the tension wrench because the pins uh, do block the rake from getting in there. So I put it down by the tension wrench and I pull up. And then it's sort of just like using the hook. You have I use to feel the pins. I don't actually just like rake. I use it to just feel the pins. It's a little bit easier that way in my opinion. And it's a little quicker. So I just unlocked the lock with a ball rake, as you can see. Now I'm going to use my hook. Lock it back up. Insert my tension wrench again. And then you can just move the front pin out of the way with the hook. And basically what you do with the ball rake, you're going to want to lift the pins up, pin by pin. As you can tell, I'm not uh, rattling the doorknob very much, so this is uh, sort of a quiet thing. It's not, it's not really for burglary, but I'm not going to sit there and make a lot of noise on the doorknob. Okay, so I just picked it with the hook. Now I'm going to pick it with the half diamond. Now, this isn't really my particularly favorite uh, pick for the doorknob because it's just, I don't know, it doesn't... It doesn't have a good feel to it. It's, I, in my opinion, I, I like it a little bit more just for picking, um, just for picking padlocks. Um, another thing I'd like to mention is that the quick set doorknob that I'm using currently, it's not very safe. It's, it's an easy pick thing for amateurs, and it's probably not one of the safer doorknobs. So if this is your main door, which this isn't our main door to gain access into our house, uh, we have a storm door in front of it with a schlag deadbolt which is extremely hard to pick so um, I would recommend switching it out if this is your main lock okay so I'm gonna pick the uh, quick set doorknob lock with the half diamond this is more of a doorknob rattle because it's uh, I don't really know how to explain it. it just doesn't have the same feel to it as the ball rake does and the hook do so This does take a little bit longer for me with this piece. I, I can't under, I can't explain why. It's just I don't like the way it feels inside the lock. I will have uh, video responses to my other videos in the uh, under the video if you guys are looking for other. Uh, tutorials or how to's on picking locks. I have my lock picking for beginners video which I will be posting as well as my uh, how to on how to pick a master combination lock through the back keyway. As you can see I still haven't unlocked this lock. I'm going to actually reset the pins now and I'm going to start over. Sometimes that's all you need to do is just reset it and you'll get it. Okay, so there you have it. I've picked uh, a quick set doorknob lock, if that's what you want to call it, by using three picks and my tension wrench. Um, I've used the half diamond as well as the ball rake and the hook. So, thanks for watching. This is Carrier2013. Uh, like I said, I'll have the video responses under the video if you want to take a look at those. So, uh, I'll see you later. Bye. <laughs>